pop therapy video. So exciting. Today, I'm here to talk to you about um, a popular topic at the moment, which is gratitude. Um, gratitude seems to be a little bit of a buzzword at the moment. Uh, every man and his dog is trying to sell a gratitude journal or um, get us to practice gratitude. Um, but why is gratitude such a buzz at the moment? What's so special about it? And is there any evidence to say that practicing gratitude is actually beneficial for us? Well, there's actually been quite a bit of research that has shown that practicing gratitude can be a really good thing for our well-being. Uh, the reason why practicing gratitude is good for our well-being um, is because of a few different things. So the first is that when we practice gratitude, we actively have to stop and think about something good that happened. That's really important because often us humans, we're actually quite negatively wired, makes sense from an evolutionary perspective. We're more primed to notice bad things so we can stop those bad things from happening again than we are to notice good things. So sometimes we actually need to practice getting better at noticing the good things that happen to us. Um, so really good thing. The second reason why gratitude is beneficial is that when we stop and reflect on things we're grateful for, often we actually express our gratitude to others. So if someone's done something nice for us, we might then tell them that we're grateful and we appreciate that thing. So doing that strengthens our social bonds and can help us build our relationships, which is a fantastic thing for our well-being and our mental health. The third reason why grat gratitude is good for us is that gratitude is a positive emotion. And we know through research, uh, there's a theory called the Broaden and Build Theory um, that show that when we experience positive emotions, we think in a different way. We think more creatively. We're better problem solvers when we're experiencing positive emotions. So when you're practicing gratitude, it's a great way to experience some positive emotions. So there's three benefits of gratitude and why practicing it can be good for our mental health and well-being. So how do you go about practicing gratitude? A really simple, te simple technique that you can try uh, is called the three good things exercise. All you have to do at the end of the day, take a few minutes to reflect and then write down three good things that happened that day and why. The why is a really important piece of the puzzle because it helps you to reflect on what you did or the effort you put in to make that good thing happen. So super important to think about why. You could also try this as a family activity, something you do around the dinner table or something you do with friends. Great activity to do. Uh, for those of you in workplaces, you could try something called a gratitude board. This is just putting up some kind of notice board, whiteboard, where you all share you know, photos, post-its, hell, even stickers, things you're grateful for, um, and create a bit of a gratitude board. Really nice way to share some of those positive messages and things you're grateful for. You could do one at home too, if you really wanted. Um, so these are two really simple ways you can practice gratitude. dark side to gratitude. I know positivity in the psychology field is all of a buzz at the moment, um, but is there a dark side to gratitude? The only caution I would say is that it's important to acknowledge that we can't always be positive 24-7. That just wouldn't be right. Um, all emotion, whether it's good or bad, is normal human emotion. So there are days where sometimes we might have a crap day or we might feel a little bit anxious and that's okay acknowledging and accepting that sometimes we have those kind of emotions is a really important thing for our mental health as well. So um, just a little caution for anyone on the gratitude bandwagon doesn't mean you have to be super positive all the time, but if you're finding you're becoming a little bit of a negative Nelly, practicing gratitude is a great way to start noticing the positives a little bit more. Thanks for watching today's Pop Therapy TV. Bye.